let us discuss about general terms used in refraction of light okay consider a black this is a glass black okay this is rarer medium air and this is denser medium glass okay so what are the general terms here if a ray of light strike the surface of separation of two medium okay this is known as incident ray what is incident ray a ray which strikes the surface of separation of two media this ray is called incident ray next this point is point of incident what is point of incidence a point of the surface of separation of the optical media where the incident ray strikes is known as point of incidence this is point of incidence what are the terms here this is incident ray it strikes the surface of separation of two media at one point this point is called point of incidence this is called point of incidence next what is point of incidence a point of of the surface of separation of two media where the incident ray strikes is called point of incidence next refracted ray next term is normal what is normal here if a line drawn perpendicular to the surface of separation of two media through the point of incidence this line passes through the point of incidence and it is perpendicular to the separation of two medium this is called normal this is called normal it is perpendicular to the surface of separation of two medium and it is passes through the point of incidence this is called normal next what is the next term a ray bends in optically denser medium this ray is called refracted ray it is called refracted ray what is refracted ray ray which travels in the second optical medium this is second optical medium this is first optical medium so it travels in the second optical medium the change of angle of incident ray is known as refracted ray that means it changes its angle of incidence this is angle of incidence i and this is angle of refraction or here it is having some angle here it is changes this that angle and it is bends towards the normal okay this is called refracted ray next angle of incidence what are the next term is angle of incidence the angle which is the ray of incidence makes an angle with the normal that is the incident ray it is incident ray makes an angle with the normal this angle is called incident angle it is denoted with i okay it is denoted with i it is called angle of incidence angle of incidence this angle is called angle of incidence angle which is the ray of incidence makes an angle with the normal at the point of incidence this is point of incidence denoted with o this angle is called angle of incidence next angle of refraction the angle which is the refracted ray makes with the normal this is refracted ray it makes some angle with the normal at the point of incidence is known as angle of refraction this is denoted by r this is called angle of refraction angle of refraction okay so these are the important terms related to refraction of light what are the important terms here first one is incident ray this ray strikes the surface of separation of two media and where it is strikes it strikes one single point that point is called point of incidence and if you draw a line perpendicular to the surface of separation of two medium through the point of incidence is called normal next 
refracted ray the incident ray changes its angle changes its direction when it enters into the another optical medium so it moves in this direction this ray is called refracted ray next what is another term angle of incidence the incident ray makes an angle with the normal at the point of incidence is called angle of incidence this is angle of incidence next angle of refraction the refracted ray makes with the and makes with an angle with the normal is called angle of refraction this angle is called angle of refraction these are the important terms related to refraction of light thank you